Welcome to this Windows channel and today was Patch Tuesday, a last little video for today in this late evening of March 8. So Patch Tuesday today uh, brought some updates if you're on Windows 7, Windows 8.1, Windows um, 10, you had a certain number of security updates. Windows 7, Windows 8.1 had somewhere around 8 to 12 updates depending on your computer's configuration. On Windows 10, of course, it was a big cumulative update instead of, you know, separate updates. So on Windows 10, we have KB3140768. And this brings the Windows 10 version to 10586.164. And uh, what do we have in here? Well, if we look at the security bulletin for um, the Windows 10, first of all, Windows 10 has improved, the cumulative update brings improved support for Bluetooth, wearables and apps accessing contacts, improved reliability in app installation and narrator, improved performance for hibernation, content entry in apps and downloading and installing updates, fixed issues that didn't allow login to an Xbox from a PC running Windows 10, fixed security issue created when attempting to play corrupted content. So this is a security fix. Fixed security issue that could allow remote code execution in viewing a PDF in Microsoft Edge. So this is really the PDF reader in Edge that had a security flaw. Fixed additional issues with Net Framework, Internet Explorer 11 and networking. So these are some security issues that I've seen and additional security issues with Microsoft Edge, Internet Explorer 11, USB storage driver, kernel mode drivers, net framework, graphic fonts, uh, OLE, secondary logon, uh, log PDF library, and Adobe Flash Player again, Adobe Flash Player all the time. So um, if we look at the update itself, the security bulletin of Microsoft, so we have uh, really some flaws, uh, memory, co memory corruption flaws in IE 9.2.11, including IE 11, when on Windows 10, more than half of the 13 flaws uh, do not impact uh, Internet Explorer 9 or 10. So uh, there's a lot of things here. All 11 flaws of memory corruption, um, Microsoft Edge, lots of uh, fixes for security as we see here. Uh, so a lot of little things. Um, Open type fun parsing uh, flaw, uh, rated critical for remote code execution, denied out of service issue, rated moderate by Microsoft. A lot of little things that uh, are across Windows platforms. Uh, flaw uh, says here the flag exists in Windows because they are uh, of the way that Windows Adobe type manager library handles these specially crafted funds. So there are some interesting little things here happening. So if you are on Windows um, 8.1, Windows 7 and Windows 10, please update your machine. Lots of security stuff. Uh, even Microsoft Office software has some patches. So uh, uh, it's really interesting. Um, remaining bulletins, if you look here, patch and elevation of privilege uh, fly in Windows. Patches, another elevation of privilege bug, this one in the Windows secondary logon service. Patches of flaw in the Windows USB mass storage class driver that can be exploited with a USB device to gain privilege. So you could have been uh, basically uh, pirated using a USB key. And uh, security update for .NET, as you see here, like uh, I was saying in the first one. So lots of security updates and uh, some improvements in Windows 10. So why not go and get it? This is Patch Tuesday, and it is available right now for your Windows machine. Uh, make sure that you install all of these updates. They are of critical importance and will keep your computer safe from hackers and uh, you know just made it running smoothly. If you enjoy my videos, want to subscribe to my channel, you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, let us know. And thank you for watching 
our videos and for following us.